Hello, hello. Welcome to your mind body session. Today we're going to do um, EFT on hip pain. And as always, you can swap out uh, or replace hip pain with any other physical pain that you're having or emotional pain. So to begin, let's just take a deep breath in and then let it out. Another deep breath in and then let it out. And then before we start tapping, let's check in with the body and check in with the hips and see is the pain coming from the right hip or the left hip or both hips? Is there a shooting pain? And with that, from a scale from zero to 10, zero being no pain and 10 being through the roof pain, where are you at um, in this in that number field? And then uh, I want you to think about, do you have any emotions that are around the pain or the discomfort that you're feeling right now? Um, so your body is always speaking to you. And if we're checking in and, and wondering, you know, what is, what, what, what is my body trying to tell me? Um, <clears throat> perhaps you have some fears around moving forward or some resistance. Um, Louise Hayes, author Louise Hayes, she wrote about the hips and she said the hips, when there's issues with the hips, there's a manifestation of not wanting to move forward or resistance to moving forward. So just check in with yourself and see if that's accurate for you. And um, it's all good things to notice, but no judgment. And maybe some things will come up during this session. Uh, okay, so we're gonna start with our karate chop. And again, we bring up the negative emotions, not to camp out or you know, build a home with them, but just to acknowledge them. So then we can release them and allow for something more positive to show up, okay? So we'll start with our even though statements. So even though I have this pain in my hips, I love and accept myself. Okay, even though my body is really speaking to me with hip pain, I accept all my feelings about this and I'm ready for my hips to heal. Even though I'm feeling frustrated, discouraged, hopeless, maybe even scared, I'm open to accepting myself, my body, and I'm open to healing now. Okay, so we're gonna go through the other eight meridian points that we tap on. So we'll do the inside of the eyebrow and then you just follow along and I'll guide you. This pain in my hips, this pain in my hips, under the eye, maybe it's a sharp pain or a dull pain. Under the nose, maybe it grinds when I walk. Chin, maybe I hear it clicking. Collarbone, I feel it in the front of my hip. Under the arm, maybe the side of my hip or the back side of my hip. Top of the head, sometimes the pain shoots down my leg. Okay, we're gonna go through the process again. Eyebrow, I'm not feeling steady. Side of the eye, I'm not feeling sturdy. Under the eye, I'm feeling unbalanced, imbalanced. Under the nose, my body is speaking to me with hip pain and this may connect to my leg or my lower back or my pelvis. Under the chin, this pain in my hips is unsettling for me. 
collarbone. It's so hard to walk, so hard to sit, to stand, to climb. I just want my life back under the arms. My body is speaking to me with hip pain. Maybe I'm carrying some emotions in my hips, top of the head. I release and let go of fear in my hips, and I release and let go of anger in my hips. I release and let go of hopelessness, helplessness, and powerlessness, okay? Eyebrow, I'm letting go of the resentment in my hips, the side of the eye. I'm releasing any guilt, shame, discouragement, or fear in my hips. Under the eye, all of these emotions I might be storing in my hips. Under the nose, I also might be carrying beliefs and limitations in my hips. Under the mouth or the chin, perhaps it's been hard to make decisions in my life. Collarbone, maybe I've been vacillating from moving forward and staying stuck in a job or a relationship or a chapter in my life under the arm, something might impact my life if I change. Top of the head, I'm open to being flexible. Eyebrow, I'm open to having balance in my life. Side of the eye, perhaps I have some fears around getting older and what that means for me. Under the eye, I'm open to moving forward in my life with grace and ease. Under the nose, I'm open to feeling safe and secure in my body and in my life. Under the mouth or the chin, it can be scary to move forward, but I'm also tired of being stuck here. Collarbone, I'm tired of being stuck here. Under the arm, I'm tired of the pain and discomfort. I want to know what it can feel like to feel safe. Top of the head, what if I can feel safe? What if I can feel secure moving forward? Eyebrow, secure in my body. Side of the eye, secure in my life. Under the eye, Secure in my body. Under the nose, what if I could stand on my own two feet? The chin, what if I can have things that I like moving forward? Collarbone, feeling better and better. I'm releasing others' expectations of me and all the pressure that I have around it. Under the arms, I'm standing on my own two feet. And even though I might feel scared, I'm ready to move forward. Top of the head, I'm feeling supported and sustained. Eyebrow, I'm moving forward towards what feels right in my life. Side of the eye, I am secure with who I am. Under the mouth, I mean, under the nose, I'm secure with my life. Under the mouth, I'm setting myself free. Collarbone, I'm releasing all the emotions and all the beliefs that no longer serve me. Under the arm, I'm relaxing my hips. I'm relaxing my hip joints. Top of the head, Finding peace in my hips, finding a relaxation and support in my body, letting go of past beliefs, and open to healing and transformation with my body and my mind. So just Check in and see how how you're feeling and maybe do another round of that 
and feel free to make up on your own um, words and tap with that. That's completely okay and wonderful to do. Um, and uh, yeah, I hope that made a difference for you and we'll see you next time. Take care.